Hello and welcome back to Peace Starts With Me. I'm Tyler Hendricks. I'm going to talk about crushing the head of the serpent. How does that happen? Without the true mother, it doesn't happen. In her address inaugurating the Women's Federation for World Peace, true mother, Hak Jahan Moon, called women to bring God-centered unity of left and right into the spheres of government, finance, culture, and society at large. How? She didn't talk about political office or business activities or corporate ladders. Those are all good things, important things. But instead of that, she called women to something else. She said women should give proper guidance so that the tragedy of the fall may be resolved with the active cooperation of our husbands and children. How are women to do this? She said, embrace our husbands and properly educate our children. Her exemplars are our forebears, Rebecca, Tamar, and Mary. As True Mother described, they dominated father and son for God and purified the womb as a dwelling place of God's love. To do so, God gave them the strength of will to overcome life-threatening dangers. Obviously, True Mother did not found the Women's Federation for World Peace as a secular organization for women alone. She said this is a movement of true love for our husbands and children that must bear fruit in ideal families, establish a true concept of manhood, and model what it means to be a mother, a wife, and a daughter. She called women to build homes for true parents, true husbands and wives, and true children engaged in the holy cause of changing this fallen world into a heavenly world. Thus, True Mother launched the Women's Federation for World Peace centered on God's love. It could be called the Women's Federation for World Love. The slogan of the left, no justice, no peace, is correct with the proviso that just as justice underlies peace, so too love underlies justice. Now, who did God create to bring horizontal love into the world? Eve. And what was the fruit of the tree of knowledge? Eve's love. Eve gave it to Satan. Hak Jahan brought it back and brought it to True Father, empowering him to crush the head of the serpent. Now is the time to attend the True Father, she said, who has established the victorious tradition in world history and the True Mother, the global representative of women, who has gained victory as the representative woman in history. With women representing true mother, men can crush the head of the serpent. Together, we can create true families. Therefore, the WFWP, True Mother said, must develop someday into a federation of families for world peace. And you know what? Four years later, True Parents established the Family Federation for World Peace and Unification. Thanks for listening. I'm Tyler Hendricks. We'll talk to you again next week.